So I found the chance to make some new uh, optical measurements with the uh, setup. So I slightly uh, changed this shaft and I added a uh, ferrite bead. So the ferrite bead is below the um, the the, the center bronze uh, support. Uh, and that will uh, be in that ring. So, so that will make sure that this is pulled uh, below if it, if it goes upward. So let's, uh, let's bring it on the, the board. Okay. So now, uh, so now we have it on the board. Uh, now we can uh, grab a line. Let's uh, beef this up. So uh, now it's a nine volt, which is a bit uh, extreme. And you can see the, uh, the result here. Um, and actually you can see immediately that the lines are too far. So this is 60 micron and it's too far apart. Um, so let's, let's close that. Um, yeah, so my, uh, yeah, actually, so it's not a bad result uh, to say that first. So, so we, we do get to see four lines, which, which uh, are associated with the four facets. But what I think is that this um, shaft is better than the shaft I have now. So probably I have to uh, extract that and redo the measurements. Uh, what, what is also relevant is your distance to the... Um, to your prism, which is now 40 millimeters. So we know that it will, uh, if we go closer, that that will increase the result or improve the result, but it's still, it's not, not good enough. Uh, it's not good enough for laser exposure, but uh, there is some progress.